It is so beautiful out here. It's really sad to me that today is the day that everything goes. I'll probably leave the tomato plants and let them just die, but the frost is coming. Tomorrow night, we're gonna hit a low of 32. And then the night after is gonna be 35, and then the night after 38. And then the night after it was like 42 or something. So three nights of consecutive in the 30s, everything's gonna die. So I'm going to go ahead and harvest everything. The majority of what I have growing in all of my beds are herbs. The herbs did the best for me this year as we're still building the garden. I only had a certain amount of space and I decided to fill it up with herbs and tomatoes. Everything just looks so good. Before we start picking, how about we go through and just take a look at things. See it for the last time and admire its glory. This pak choy and all the carrots throughout the beds should be completely fine. This is the most glorious zucchini plant. I picked the zucchinis yesterday and put them in dinner. So it's just the plant left. It's huge. This is cinnamon basil. It's beautiful. It smells heavenly. All right, this is all the cinnamon basil. I picked every single plant. raspberries. Those hurt. I'm definitely gonna have a lot of weeding to do. There's there's a lot of weeds, but hey, let's let the frost kill everything off. Oh, you lovely bees. I don't want to take all of your flowers. This is all the holy basil I have, though. I'm gonna take some more, but I'll leave you flowers. In your eyes, no disguise. All right, ladies, the rest are for you. You can have all the rest. Hey, can you get on the other flower? Here, switch flowers. You want that one? Yeah, I feel you. Switch flowers, okay. Oh, oh, you all want this one? Can you have the other one? Oof, startled me. Can you go there? Can you, can you go there? Okay, well, then you just hang out for a minute. You do you, girl. It's our basket of holy basil and cinnamon basil. How's that for a basket of sage? Okay, so here is the sage plant. Now I realize that this looks so drastic, but it's the frost is coming and it's going to happen anyway. And I cut everything off dead and dying. I took everything I wanted and I left enough for photosynthesization. Photosynthization, yes, that one. 
So, and it's just going to grow and get bigger. It is perennial. I need to come mulch around it. Um, definitely cover up at least the the crown part here at the base. Um, and we'll be good. And now we are heading for the other basils. I grew four types of basils this year. Still have more to get. This is purple opal basil. This is 100% gonna die at 30 degrees. I'm taking all of the herbs inside now. Oh, I'm so ready for it to be done being hot. It's so, so uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. 